Hi, it's Brick Bros UK with an unboxing and review on the LEGO Star Wars Flash Speeder Set 75091. Here's the box set front with the battle scene from the end of the Phantom Menace film. And on the back, there's detailed pictures of the Flash Speeder and more battle scenes, as you can see. Okay, let's open and build the set. The set is aged 7 to 12 years and consists of 312 pieces. It comes with three bags of Lego, one instruction booklet, one sticker sheet, five minifigures, which two are battle droids, and the green flash speeder. It took 30 minutes to build and cost £34 and 99p in the UK. It's a great set for recreating the Phantom Menace battle scene, but does seem pricey in the UK. OK, let's check out the minifigures. Minifigures include Captain Tarples the Gungan, with brown and gold printed legs, the torso has brown and gold printing front and back, which looks good, with purple arms. Captain Tarples' head has purple and brown printing, which also looks great, and he comes equipped with a spear. The Naboo security guard minifigure has a yellow and brown colour scheme, with printed legs and a printed torso back and front. It doesn't have a dual head, but has a really nice printed brown hat, with gold front trim. It also is equipped with a small blaster. The Naboo security officer has a light blue and brown color scheme with printed legs and printed torso front and back. It comes with a dual head and large brown hat with gold trim. I haven't seen this hat on a minifigure before and it looks great. It also comes equipped with a small blaster. The battle droids are still the same build as previous sets and come equipped with a medium blaster each. Now onto the flash speeder. There's enough room to fit four Naboo security guards in the flash speeder. The Naboo security guard can sit in the driving seat just like on the box set picture. However, it's tricky to fit his legs in and clip him to the handlebars. The side doors open for quick access, as you can see. We'll just close that one. And there's two compartments to store binoculars and blasters at the back. There's the first one. And the one on the other side. There we are. Now there's six transparent plates on the bottom that allow the flash speeder to easily slide around like so. There's two flick missiles either side that move up and down. And there's a middle gun with a flick missile that can move 360 degrees. There are two stickers on the cockpit controls, as you can see. Now I'm going to demonstrate one of the side flick guns. Here's the middle flick gun in action. They're very easy to fire and the set comes equipped with an extra orange missile. Overall, it's a great set to recreate one of the battles from the Phantom Menace film. It is pricey in the UK, and it's a bit weird Captain Tarples is in the set because the Gungans fight on the Naboo planes in the film. Hope you enjoyed our Brick Bros UK unboxing and review on the LEGO Star Wars Flash Speeder set 75091. Like, comment and subscribe to Brick Bros UK.